Freedom is because of Jesus Christ and what He done on Calvary. Amen. And if He's made you free, ain't a devil in hell that can stop Him. Amen. You're free. Amen. If the Son has set you free, you're free. Praise God tonight. There's a call to freedom. We're called to it. Amen. We're called to freedom tonight. Galatians 5 and 13 says, For brethren, you have been called unto liberty, which is freedom. Only use not liberty for an occasion to the flesh, but by love serve one another. Amen. Serve one another. Amen. Don't take it for granted that you're free. Amen. Share it. Give it away. Amen. Look, that you can be free too, brother. Amen. You can be free too, sister. Let me tell you how I got free. Amen. Let me tell you how I got free. Uh, don't just take it for granted that, you know, well, I'm just free. I'm, I'm free because of who. You know. No, we're free to go and share it and go and to give it away, Brother Marcus, right? Amen. We're going to tell the world, amen, that's amen. lost and dying and is separated from God that they can be free from the bondage of sin. Amen. And the bondage of iniquity. And the bondage of failure. And the bondage of disaster. There are people, man, that they're, they're, they're bound by those things. Amen. There are people that are bound. They just think that, well, if it weren't for bad luck, I'd have no luck at all. Come on. Huh? Come on. And come on, preacher. Amen. I've run into them church people. Amen. If it weren't for bad luck, we'd have no luck at all. Amen. I'm going to tell you, if it wasn't for Jesus, I wouldn't be here. Amen. I can tell you that for a fact. I know how it was. I know what God has delivered me from. I know where God has brought me from. Amen. I've been called to freedom. And not, not called just to keep it to myself, but called to give it away, Brother Jesse. I'm going to show other people how they can be free. Amen. I'm going to lead them to the cross. I'm going to point them to Him. Amen. Don't, you look at my life as an example of what God has done for me. And I'm going to go over here and I'm going to point somebody that's in the, in the same situation as me towards Jesus. Amen. Let me tell you what Jesus did for me. Amen. I'm going to be, let me tell you how God delivered me. Let me tell you what Jesus, how He has made me free. Amen. He's made me free tonight. Amen. Because of my acceptance and my obedience to Him. Amen. I praise the Lord tonight because we've been called to freedom. Amen. There's freedom in Christ and we've been called to freedom. My last point I make tonight is we're free tonight from sin. Amen. We're, we have the God-given right to tell the devil no. Amen. And whether or not you want to believe it, young people, you have the God-given right to tell the devil no. Amen. We're free tonight from sin. 1 Corinthians 10 and 13 says, There hath no temptation taken you, but such as in common to man. But God is faithful, who will not suffer you to be tempted above that you are able, but will with the temptation also make a way of escape. Amen. Uh, you, we, are t we are free tonight. Amen. From sin. Because with every temptation, God's made a way out. Amen. Uh, it don't matter. We don't have to stand there. Uh, Brother Jesse, if that pops up on my phone, I got the God-given right to hit the end button. Amen. I got the God-given right to turn that sucker off. Amen. I got the God-given right to turn the channel. I got the God-given right to turn the station. Amen. I don't have to give in to sin tonight. Because I have freedom from sin. I have the God-given right to tell the devil no because I don't belong to the devil. Amen. I'm a child of the King. Amen. I'm a child of God. Amen. I, I'm royalty tonight. Amen. I don't have to sit there and wallow in the muck and the mire just because the world says it's okay. You don't have to just sit there and take it. You can tell the devil no. You can turn it off. You can turn away and you can walk away from it and leave it alone. And just plain stop. For some people, they just need to quit. You just need to stop. Doing whatever it is you're doing, just stop. Period. Because it's as simple as that. We, we think it's, oh, well, it's bigger than me. Oh, it'll take more. I'll never... Listen, he said, with every temptation, he said, I've made a way of escape. Amen. Amen. Tonight, if you're being tempted by the devil, seek God. Amen. If the devil, if the devil is coming at you, you tell that sucker to get away from you. That he smells bad, his breath stinks. You ain't got time for him. To tell him to get away from you. Amen. And leave you alone. Amen. That's the biggest thing. Is that we won't tell the devil to get away from us. 
We, we, just, we, we don't think about, listen, I've, been, I've walked down the road before. I've walked through Walmart before. Devil, get away from me! And had to tell him to get away from me. Because I ain't got time for him. Amen. We're living late in time, Brother Gillis. Amen. I'm living, uh, we're living late. Late in time, the king is coming. And I know that, you know, this, uh, the freedom that we have in Christ Jesus, amen, it's a special kind of freedom. It don't come with any qualifications. You don't have to be well of speech. You don't have to know the Bible front to back. You don't have to uh, have a button-up shirt and cleaned up my tie and nice pretty hair. Amen. You can come just exactly as you are and accept this freedom that God has for you. Amen. And you can truly experience what freedom really is in your life and what it really feels like to live free. I tell you right now, I, there are some days I, I just don't know how I keep not just flying away. Because I feel so free sometimes. Because I don't have to I don't have that old junk that's bearing me down and weighting me down and hold me and, and, and trying to keep me complacent and trying to tell me, no, it's not good enough. Oh, I don't do oh the devil, he'll just sit down right beside you. I've I've used that a hundred times. I did it the other day, sit down on the bed. Oh no, yeah, I know you just do so much for the church. You're all right. You just sit right there, bless God. Yeah, you're just so pitiful and all that, you know. And the devil he'll climb right in there and that's how you talk to you. Amen, but I'm free tonight. I'm free tonight, Brother Jesse. Hallelujah. There ain't no chains holding me. I'm not bound by this world. I'm not, I'm not connected to nothing here. Amen. I, I mean, I'm connected to the vine. Amen. The true vine. Amen. To Jesus tonight. You want to experience freedom in your life. True and ultimate freedom. True and ultimate freedom. It's only found in one place. And that's in Jesus Christ. It's only found in one place. It's not found anywhere else. Walmart ain't got it. Uh Amazon don't sell it. And I'm going to tell you right now, if Sloan's ain't got it, you don't need it. (laughs) Amen? Sloan's don't have it. They don't have freedom. Only Jesus tonight has true freedom. Amen? You can experience true freedom in your life tonight. If you would stand with me tonight, amen? Jamie, I'd like for you to get a song. And the praise team, if you would come back up, and we'll, we'll worship God tonight. Because, amen, we are the children of God. And everybody in this place, I, I, you know, sometimes I know I'm preaching to the choir. I think you guys understand how free you are tonight. But I want you to worship. You're free to worship tonight. Yeah. Amen. I ain't nobody looking at you. I, I, want you. I want you to close your eyes. I want you to get in a box tonight. And I want you to worship God however you feel like you need to worship God tonight. Young people... I want you to close your eyes and I just want you to get along with God. Forget about your boyfriend. Forget about your girlfriend. Forget about your cell phone. Forget about your computer. I want you to get uh, close your eyes tonight. And I want you to get in a box tonight with God. And I want you to begin to worship Him and praise Him because you know why? Because He's worthy. Amen. He sent His Son Jesus to die on the cross so that we could be free tonight. We could stand here tonight and we could worship Him. And we could praise Him. For all that He's done in our life, we thank God tonight because He's worthy to be praised for what He's done for us and what He's going to do, what He's continuing to do. Hey, I want you to worship Him tonight. If you have a need, I want you to come to the altar tonight. We'll pray with you. We'll meet you down here. Uh, Not just pray at you, we'll pray with you. Amen. We want to pray with you, strengthen you. you, you, You're going through something tonight, know that these altars are always open. Praise God tonight for freedom. The freedom that I have and the liberty that I have when I come into this house to worship God. It's not a fake. It's not a facade. It's not something that's put on. This is true freedom. Amen. You know why I can dance when I'm over there singing? Because I'm free. Amen. You know why Jesse can play that tambourine? Because he's free. You know why we can raise our hands and we can shout? Because we're free. Amen. We're free tonight. Ain't no chains. Ain't no chains holding us. Ain't no chains holding us. We're free tonight. Amen. We've been set free. Yes. yes, we've been set free tonight. We praise God tonight for the blood that was shed on Calvary for our freedom, God. We praise you, God. You're worthy, Father, to be praised. And God, you're in this place today. And God, we, God, we feel your presence. God, we ask, Father, you come down. And God, and you touch. Father, and you, you show us, God, and you allow us to praise you and worship you, God, for who you are, God, and what you're doing in our lives and what you're going to do, Father. Yes, Father, we praise you. Hallelujah, God, you're worthy, Father, tonight. Father, you're worthy, God, tonight to be praised, Father. 
God, we thank you tonight, God, for our freedom, God, that we have in this place, God. And Father, we thank you, God, that we're no longer bound by addiction. Amen? Amen. Hallelujah. We're, we're no longer bound by sin. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. But, God, the, sh- the chains have been taken off, God. The still door is open, God. Father, tonight, God, we worship you in freedom, Father, tonight, God. We're free to worship. We're free to dance, God. We praise your name, God, for all things. God, you're worthy, Father, to be praised tonight in this place. Father, we thank you, God, for this group of people, God, that's here that love you, God. Father, that want to worship you, that want to praise you, God, that have a desire, God, and a heart for you, Father. We thank you, God, uh, for these people. God, bless them tonight, Father, as they worship you. God, and they give you praise tonight, God, and honor and glory. Father, you are worthy, God, to be praised. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thanks for joining with us for the broadcast from New Beginning Worship Center in Greenback, Tennessee. We are located at 6501 Highway 411 South in Greenback, Tennessee, zip code 37742. Emails may be addressed to nbwcmailbox at gmail.com. Pastor Marcus Severance and the congregation invite you to join with us Sundays at 10 a.m. for teaching followed by worship services at 11 a.m. and 6 p.m. We also meet midweek at 7 p.m. on Wednesdays. We're located on Highway 411 in Greenback, Tennessee, just three buildings down from the intersection of Highway 95. If you can't meet with us in person, please join us again next time for our broadcast.